What's up, racers and collectors? CB here. So I had a little uh, downtime today, so I thought I'd hit the uh, thrift stores. And I tell you what, I was not disappointed today. I've got something to show you that I'm really, really excited about. Um, couldn't believe my eyes when I first saw it. Um, first of all, I went to a place called Kids Closet um, in Vero Beach, Florida, and $6.99 for this trade of cars and I saw one immediately in there that I thought wow that's that's awesome so I picked it up and it wasn't until I got home when I realized what I really had I, I'm gonna go jump into the best ones in here there were some that just were not that great but um, there's t at least two in here that blew my mind and I'm just gonna jump right in and show you them um, first of all BMH W 1977, you are gonna love this. Your favorite car, the 308, uh, what is it, the, the uh, race bait 308, that's right. Um, and look at the shape it's in. And I saw this, I thought, yep, that, that alone right there is worth it. It is in really, really good shape. Wheels are in great shape. Um, just got really excited when I saw that. Um, even better than this though, I'll just go right to the one that really blew my mind, this one, the Rolls Royce. Um, look at the shape this thing is in. Um, not sure about the year on this thing, 1979. I have one of these uh, that I had when I was a kid, still have it, and it looks like, you know, a toy that's been played with since 1979 not nearly in this good a shape um look at that i mean it's it's gorgeous so i i saw i didn't even see this when i first picked up the bag and i just took a quick peek when i got home and i was like wow that is fantastic um a couple other really good ones in here too uh this corvette uh hot wheels corvette um, I didn't take a really good look at it, and I don't know a whole lot about it. Uh, so I don't know what year this was from. It says 1994 on the bottom. But uh, another one that's in really good shape. Really cool model. like that a lot. And then another Corvette from Matchbox. Again, great shape. Um, this one I don't know the year on either. Um... 19, 1982 uh, 68 Corvette 1982 um, I remember I have I have a lot of old matchbox with these kind of wheels and I loved them the suspension on them was fantastic look at that bounce and they were really fast so I was really excited to see this uh, in there as well a couple uh, a couple that weren't that great this one was cool um, <laughs> I have my own personal reasons for liking this one. I actually have this model as well. My first car when I turned 16 was a 1984 Fiero. So uh, I always tried to pick up Fieros whenever I saw one. And uh, this just happened to be in here. And this is actually in better shape than the one I have. So I was happy to see that. Uh, what else? Uh, I saw this and at first I was really excited because, oh hey, it's the old you know, Hot Bird, Hot Wheels Hot Bird, but no, it's not. It's Tomica, but it is it is an older model, and it's actually really nice. It's got the opening doors. Um, would prefer it to be the Hot Bird, but I'll take it. You can just tell by the uh, the wheels. The wheels just aren't as as nice. And imagine my disappointment getting this. Looks like another one for the cars that make me go, hmm. Uh, anyone know anything about this? This is an MR2, and there's nothing really on the bottom, but it is so typical of a Matchbox model. And I first saw it, I thought it was a Matchbox. But it's not. Or is it? I don't know. It sure looks like it. A little scrapes on the front, but other than that, it's not bad. A uh, little older model. This is probably a maze still. I don't know. There's nothing on the bottom. But uh, cool little pickup truck. 
Kaiser. I don't know what that means. Uh, what else? And then the uh, Merker XR4TI. Remember these pieces of crap? Yeah, try finding one of these that's still on the road. Um, but the models, the uh, Matchbox had a really cool model. This, this isn't Matchbox. I don't know what this is. Um, but I have a couple uh, Matchbox ones, and right, they were actually really cool. Uh, in real life, though, the car was a bomb. But, uh, I don't know, that's kind of neat. And just uh, other than that, just uh, it's got a Racing Champions Terry Labonte car. Real good shape. And then I went on and picked this up at the same place. $10 for this huge bag. Man, I'm looking at them. Most of them look pretty rough. Uh, there might be a few gems in here. Let's just crack it open and see what we find. Oh my gosh. I had to get the jaws of life to open this bag. I'm exhausted. All right, we're just gonna go through these really quick. They're all in pretty rough shape. Really rough shape. I'm um, just gonna look for anything that stands out. And if anything stands out to you, put it in the uh, comments section. So far, these are all in pretty rough shape. Um, somebody had a great time with these cars. These are well played with. And a lot of fantasy models, it looks like, too. Um, yeah. Waiting to hoping to find. Now, that's nice. Uh, it's a Ferrari. Again, really beat up. 612 Scagliati. That would be a beautiful model if it was. That may be a good restoration piece right there. I don't think I've ever even seen this model. Um, no uh, year on it. Uh, let me know if you know anything about this car in the comments. If it's worth hanging on to or what. A uh, little X Racer. That's, uh, that might be good for cars that make you go hmm because that's making me go hmm right now. Uh, Mustang, just beat up. Now this one's in really good shape. Uh, go figure, it's a Motor Max. <laughs> I have never heard of Motor Max. Uh, that's a Motor Max also, but isn't that a Hot Wheels model? Now I'm really confused. Um, yeah, that, that, that's that, that's a Hot Wheels model that I, I can't think of the name of her right now, but is this some kind of a ripoff? I don't know. I don't know. What in the, oh, wow, okay. Yeah. That's cool. Um, uh, that's a, yeah, that Toyota RSC. And you can tell these have been doused in water because all the uh, wheels are rusted. So far, no. That's that. You know, that one's in good shape. X Racer fantasy car. Uh, I already have this one. That's a Maisto. Is it Maisto or Maisto? I, I keep hearing different people saying different things. I don't know. Oh, that's cool. That I actually like. Um, kind of dusty and dirty, but that's the, what is it, the gov governor? Something like that. Uh, the governor, yeah. I actually like that model a lot. And this one's, this one's <laughs> one of the in better shape ones. Uh, I got a Porsche Panamera. I think that's uh, Play Mind. Play Mind. Uh oh. These are all pretty much fantasy models. Um, uh, there's a nice little Mustang. That's a Maisto. 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 And there's a Audacious. Yeah, a little beat up. So, so far I'm saying that this was probably not worth 10 bucks. A little disappointed. Good grief. What the heck happened to that thing? But still very excited 
about uh, the first group. Whoa. This looks like something out of Mad Max. It's a Hot Wheels. Fast bed hauler. Interesting. <laughs> oh, I have a, I have one of these. These are actually really cool, but good grief. Really tore up. Elwood's Rod Shop. <laughs> and another one of these. Okay. We're almost done here. Uh, looks like a Camaro. A very weird looking Camaro. Hey, a Skyline that's in really good shape. Well, no, I take that back. It's not. <laughs> and you can tell that those wheels are, are rusted. Um, that's a shame. It's a cool car. Uh, this is cool. This one's in good sh eh, fairly decent shape. Another fantasy car pony up. Uh, again, that'd be really cool if it was better shape. Here's another one of those Motor Max. Um, that's weird. The different wheels. Uh, I don't know anything about these Motor Max. Um, if anyone knows anything, let me know. I already got this one. A little Doom Buggy. Ah, I got a Camaro here. And looks like somebody tried to destroy it. And how's that Ferrari? Ah, oh. yeah, F35. Ah, it's a shame. Crying shame. Look at that. I, yeah, you know, I say it's a crying shame, but you know what? The, these these were meant to be played with. When you're a kid, you're not thinking about the long term. You just want to have fun. So it's it's good to see that uh, these toys were played with very well. Very well. A little too much, maybe. Alright, now that's cool. Um, that would be awesome if it was in good shape. Uh, too bad. But, last one. Got a Chrysler 300 here. Yeah. Um, oh well. well that's, that's that for that, but you know, I'm definitely going back to, to this one and this one just made it all worthwhile um beautiful models uh great shape so that's my quick little thrift haul um, video and if you have any questions or comments uh, leave them down below and we'll talk to you all soon thanks for watching